Airbnb is expanding its role in the fight against human trafficking. For years, Airbnb has been working with the nonprofit Polaris. They created training for staff to spot signs of exploitation, and now they're expanding that training to Airbnb hosts and guests. We're going to be focusing on things like instead of just knowing the signs, it's also knowing the story. So what are those contexts behind the signs? Now, it's important to note that not all human trafficking involves commercial sex. It can be any kind of forced labor. Polaris estimates that 25 million people are trafficked worldwide. In recent weeks, the hospitality industry has faced lawsuits and accusations of not doing enough to combat the crime. Polaris says hotels need a different perspective compared to Airbnb. The traditional hospitality companies uh, have a very different business model than the short-term rentals um, and then other things that we're seeing in the gig economy. So we can't use these same interventions for each one because uh, there's no silver bullet. It depends on the type of trafficking most likely to utilize a certain business. Um, and then it you have to look at the business model itself. Airbnb's new training is expected to start later this year. Now, if you or someone you know needs help, Polaris operates the National Human Trafficking Hotline. We have the number right here on your screen, 1-888-373-7888.